Dear God, please watch over us today as we go into these areas of town. If there's an animal, a dog, a cat, or otherwise that we should find and help, please make them visible to us and give us the strength to continue this important work. This one needs some help. You know. Look at this dog living. Mm -hmm. Look at him oh. on that. My God. Tina Lundquist Faust and her sister Tama are the founders of a nonprofit called Houston Pet Set. The situation here in Houston is dire. It's a quality of life public safety issue. We have too many stray animals on our streets. They did not sign up for this. You know, when we domesticated them, we made a deal with them. We would take care of them. They would be in our homes. We would feed them. We failed them so miserably. Animals living in complete filth, suffering. Rescues are full and the streets are packed. What do you do? I'm a street feeder here in what is called the corridor, the place where they dump dogs that have been used for breeding, that have been used for fighting and baiting. How has it gotten like this? Why don't the elected officials care? I get mad at the people that don't do anything, because if everybody would do a little bit, we could fix it. Everybody's looking for someone else to do it, right. but we have to be the change. Yeah that we want to see. Tina named him Walter. Walter! <laughs> They're kind of like these unicorns of rescue. They can make so much positive change in the city of Houston. We have more resources. We have more groups helping. The shelters are better. But the problem is getting worse. The animals are breeding faster. We've got leaders continually blocking these efforts. Until we change the hearts and minds of people, we will carry this burden. At this stage, we wonder, is there any hope for the animals?